Okay, so now I'm in to my orders and shipping tab. Go, go, go. Say go. So I have this little priorities insert that goes inside my planner. I'm setting up for my plan with me video and as you can see I have moved my ring light above my desk. just started the video by cutting up Brent's food because she was not patient this morning and she was crying until she got her food and her milk so she was really hungry and now I'm going to make her some French toast and myself some French toast too so I did like a little um, 10 minute routine this morning of just getting ready I just took a shower but I didn't wash my hair so if you see my little you know friend sticking up there that is why and I did some quick makeup and now we are going to be ready for the day. I'm doing a lot of work on my YouTube or my Etsy shop during the day. I have to make the choice to not get ready that much that day and to kind of take my shower the night before or at least not wash my hair because that takes up a lot of time and then I have less time to be able to work on my stuff in the morning while Bryn's occupied with her show. After breakfast, we're gonna play for a little bit and then she's gonna have just a little bit of TV time, maybe like a half an hour. She loves watching TV in her little jumper and that keeps her entertained while I finish up some of my packages and will not finish up but kind of start because I have a lot of work to do today and I'm going to take you guys along with me and show you guys what I do in a day where I have a lot of work to do. So I'm really excited. I love making YouTube and Etsy videos and I hope you guys enjoy them too. I hope you're not too bored because I did just do an Etsy video but this video is kind of going to be more of a day in the life and I'm going to show you guys what I do when I film my YouTube videos as well, and I'm gonna kinda of show you guys around my office. It's a complete disaster, but we're hoping to organize it this weekend. So if we get to that, that organizing and kind of decorating our office will be in this vlog as well. So stay tuned. We got some French toast cooking. I just mixed up my eggs, vanilla, milk, and cinnamon. And this is a big separate now, but still stir that around. And then just dip the bread in it and then make some French toast. I'm sure you guys all know how to make French toast. Bon appetit. Bryn got a tiny sprinkle of sugar and she is loving it. So I got a ton of orders this week because I was running a promotion and I put out a couple stuffing my envelope videos and then a weekly check-in and a lot of people saw those and they must have liked my new designs because I got I think like close to 25 orders and that's a ton for me because it's just me making them by myself and they are very time consuming. So I really wanted to get a jump start. I think I made five um, a couple days ago and then today I have seven here to mail out. And I have them all packaged up with people's names on them. 
And then what I have to do is I just have to find their name once I get into Etsy, and then I'm just gonna print out these seven labels, and then the rest will have to wait until Monday because I don't know if I mentioned this, but it is Saturday today, so today is the last day I can mail on the weekend, and I'm going to be doing that. I think I missed the mail coming by my house, so I'm gonna have to run them to the post office as soon as I print them out. And I'm gonna look right now and see if I'm able to show you guys um, what the website looks like when I'm printing out my labels, but I don't know if it'll show people's personal information, so let me check that really quick. Okay, so now I'm in to my orders and shipping tab, and I think I'm able to show this page just because it doesn't have anyone's um, address or anything. It just has names, but I'm sure no one will mind like their name just popping up. But it just shows kind of um, what they ordered, if they ordered labels, if they don't have labels. And then I'm just going to go through and I'm going to put a check next to the ones that I want to print out, the ones that I have done. So we will be... Just putting checks next to all these. This one I actually have to skip until Monday because I did not get that one done. I didn't have one of these designs um, in time to do. So that is one of the ones that's going to have to wait. I did have Tina. So now I have my seven checked. You can see there's seven here and I'm just going to click get shipping labels. Okay, now that I'm ready to purchase my labels, it brings me to this screen after I checked through all of them. And all I have to push is just this purchase button down here. So I'm gonna click that. And then now I will be able to print shipping labels and it'll pull up the shipping labels. I can't um, obviously show people's addresses, but it'll pull up the shipping labels and I have it set to print two per sheet to save um, some paper. So now I'm just gonna print these out. And now while those are printing, I'm gonna go back and all I, and it will say print packing slips. So now it's gonna bring up all the packing slips. I do have my label at the top here. I'm just trying not to show anyone's address, but then um, it'll print the packing slip that I have made for them. And then this slip is one for myself that I get to keep and it has their tracking number and everything for their package on here that I file in my office. And then it has all of the packing labels for what I'm gonna need to print today. I was watching this that has a sticker shop and they use the silhouette. If anyone has an idea as to why my computer is freezing up when I try to print something out, let me know because I'm getting really frustrated. I'm trying to add stickers to my shop and I have them all designed, but every time I go to print them, it just spins and spins. It printed like a few successfully yesterday, but then I had to stop because it kept doing this and now I have to figure out what this problem is. So I just wanted to give a little update. I did finally get my silhouette to work and I'm so excited about this. I designed all my stickers as you will see later in the video and I hope to be doing a separate video about designing stickers soon and also on how to print and cut them out. So let me know if that's something that you're interested in and make sure you stay tuned until the end of the video so you can see all my new stickers designs that I got successfully done.
Okay, so now I have my stack of labels here and then I am going to go through and I'm going to put the labels on each one so I have a little sticky note that I started with on the package and then when I put them into the envelopes with their packing slips, I move the sticker to the outside so that way I can go through and quickly tape all the labels on these. And I know it would make it a lot easier if I had a label machine, but I was gonna wait until I started putting the stickers in my shop to see if that takes off and if I have more orders because I rarely have over 20 orders at a time. So it doesn't take too long to just cut those out and tape them on. But we will see if I end up getting one. And also now Brittany's joining me. Hi! Because she was sick of watching her show, so I just brought her toys out here. So I'm going to run through and do that really quick, and then we have to hurry up and head to the post office. We just got back from the post office, and now we're going to go for a little walk around the block. I have Brynn in her stroller here, and we're going to get a little exercise in and a little outside time while it's still nice here in Michigan. Brittany, do you want to go for a ride? She's not too like expressive today, so. So our walk didn't last very long because I realized it was really hot out. So we stopped, we made a little pit stop at the swing and we're gonna swing. Brittany, one, two, three, whee! Side time might be a fail. We had to take the pants off because it's a little hot out. Are you playing? Do you like the grass? Hey. Oh, caca, caca, caca. Brittany say caca. Yucky. You don't want to eat it. Go, go, go! Say go, go, go! She's going. Uh-oh, did you get stuck? Are you stuck? We need to rake this grass up. Oh, 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 careful! Here, turn it this way. Go, go, go. Oh. So we came inside and I fed Bryn some lunch and now I'm just going to do a little bit of cleaning up before her nap time. She's just down here playing and she'll just play out here while I clean most days. Um, so I'm gonna try to do that before her nap time so when her nap time comes, I can get down to business and get all of my stuff for my shop done and I'm gonna have to film a YouTube video during her nap. But first, let me show you guys my planner today of the things that I need to accomplish. So I have this little priorities insert that goes inside my planner, and this is the Erin Condren planner in case anyone wonders. It will be linked in the description box, and there is a $10 off coupon that you can use for your first purchase. But anyways, I just wanted to show you guys that I'm using this today, even though I have the day spread, um, I didn't really know ahead of time how many things I wanted to do, so I kind of covered some of that up. So today I just thought it would be fun to use this little insert, and it's a wet dry erase insert. It's not really focusing very well. Okay, there we go. So I'm going to use this little insert, and I have to sweep, do the dishes, clean the counters, and clean the bathroom for my daily chores. So before Burns Nap, I'm going to try to get the kitchen and sweeping accomplished. And then during Bryn's nap, I will be, and actually I already mailed packages, but during Bryn's nap, I will be um, filming a video, filming my plan with me. And right now I'm working on filming my Etsy and YouTube video. Then I will be making envelopes and I need to work on my stickers and I want to clean my office because let me show you guys what I am dealing with. It's a huge mess. Everywhere you look there is stuff accumulating because I keep purchasing things to decorate and we haven't started decorating yet. So then it just all gets put in here. I have my organizers that I'm trying to organize my drawers with, but I've been overwhelmed with orders and I think I have like 
I have like 25 orders to make, so there has been no time to clean. I just keep piling stuff, and this is just my workspace right now, but I really want to organize it. I started with the drawers, and they look pretty good. I organized that drawer, and then I also organized this drawer. So those drawers look nice, but I need to get my middle drawer sorted out with my organizer that was on the floor. And then I also just need to get the whole office under control in general. And it's hard because I need to keep toys in here for her to play with. So that way when I'm busy working on stuff, she can kind of play. She only plays for like five minutes until she's like getting into something. But, but that's the struggle today. So I want to get all this cleaned up. And this mess is just from last night from the scraps when I was making some envelopes. Let's get started and I'm going to first check off. I love checking things off. So even sometimes when I make a checklist after I've already started doing things, I still put down something that, I'll sometimes put down something that I already accomplished just so I can check it off because it kind of makes you feel good that you got something done. But I'm gonna check off that I mailed my packages this morning and then now we will be on to sweeping and cleaning the kitchen. Okay, so here's the verdict. Let's see if we can focus. I don't know what happened. Um, the blade was cutting too deep again, even though I changed the settings. So I got a whole bunch that stuck on the sheet. So this is another fail. And it so now that I'm giving up on the silhouette for a little while because I'm getting a little frustrated, I do need to film a plan with me during Bryn's nap because this is the time that I have to film. And since today's Saturday, Drew does get home from work after her nap, so then I will have time to work on my envelopes and work on my stickers. But I really need the quiet time to film the plan with me because when Drew and Bryn are playing, it's not very quiet around here. And then I get a lot of their noise in the background. So I'm going to film that right now and I'm going to take you guys into my office. I'm going to show you guys how I clean up for that and how I pick out my stickers and the supplies that I'm going to need to film the video and kind of get that set up and then I'm going to film the video. And it's a little bit deceiving to you guys because when you see me do a plan with me, you might think my office is clean, but just know it's not clean. It's just the little area that you're seeing that's clean and the rest of my office is probably a disaster. for my plan with me video and as you can see I have moved my ring light above my desk and my camera will go screwed right in here um, when I have to film that so you guys will see like a desk view 
But I'm just going to show you guys right now that um, when I film my plan with me, I need to pick out a spread for next week. So I'm going to go into my sticker box and kind of show you guys what I have. I'm going to put my camera up here right now in my desk view to get ready for filming my video. And then I will show you guys what stickers I'm picking out for this week. And then I'm going to get busy filming my plan with me. My plan with me is going to go out Monday. So that will already be out by the time you guys are watching this video because this video will be out on Wednesday. And that's just kind of how my schedule works out. I always put my plan with me's out on Monday um, just because it's the beginning of the week. And I figure that is probably the most motivating day for people to start planning their week and watching plan with me's. But let me know what you guys think and if you'd rather see them a different day. So I'm pretty sure I just was not filming the entire time I was talking to you guys. Um, but I was just showing you that I marked off that I swept and that I am filming my plan with me right now. So I just marked off those two things. And now I'm just going to pick out my stickers quick for this week. So I'm going to get into my little sticker box. And this is actually the box that my life planner came in. And I just use it to keep my stickers in. And of course I put the Planner Kate sticker on here because most of my stickers are from Planner Kate. So now before I start planning, I'm going to take a minute and just write down all my plans for the week that I know I need to mark in my planner. It will just kind of help things run smoother. So last week I planned with this succulent kit. And this week, let's see what our options are. Okay, I just realized that my stickers were not in this box, the full kits that I had. So I think I might try one of these kits. This isn't a Planner Kate kit, but I think I might try one of these. I have these really cute fall kits, but I was gonna try to save those for October. And then of course I have Bryn's birthday kit, but that is going to be saved for Bryn's birthday week. So I think I'm going to use this kit right here and we'll kind of test out that for this week. So that is what I do before I start my plan with me is I just pick out those stickers. And now I'm gonna film my plan with me and I will see you guys after I'm done when Bryn wakes up from her nap. And then when Drew gets home, I will start working on my envelopes and show you guys um, the orders that I have, how many orders I have at that time, and how many I think I'll be able to get done this weekend. Mm -hmm. 